friends, I am doing another video. <laughs> I, uh, I just did a video with um, the American Girl doll accessories of the hula outfit and the, um, I'm gonna turn you guys, and the implements, and there she is! Super excited about that. But I wanted to do a Bath and Body Works um, haul with you guys. But let me, let me fix this up. And you know what? I had like some great, great sun. I didn't even have my lights on. Sunshine was coming through the window and I only did my video maybe 30 minutes. Danielle and I were having fun with it. Now, the sun is going away. So that's Seattle life here. We barely get the sun. And when we do get the sun, we get super excited and then it just suddenly just disappears on us. Okay, so I have, I have just a Sephora gift card in here. That's for a birthday gift that I'm gonna put aside. So I try to get like a, like Sephora gift cards, but there's also like Lush gift, gift cards and um, that's why I always have candles for Valentine's Day. You got the bus drivers, you got the teachers, you got the mail lady, you got the UPS man, so he's not gonna get a candle. He's probably gonna get like chocolates from Trader Joe's. So that's why I always have these, because like they're nice to give. But I had told you guys during, after the holidays, um, Bath and Body Works had their 75% off. It started with 50, then it went to 75, and then actually it went to 80. So I got some stuff here um, that was 75 and 80% off. So really good deal. And I just stock up on my candles because I gifted a lot of them during the holidays. And then I do give some too to my hula sisters, my, um, my friends. Um, when I just wanna, you know, I want them to feel special. No, no special holiday sometimes. Um, there's this special hula lady that I always talk to. She's so sweet, so I wanted to gift her. I think this was a, one of my friend's uh, son had a birthday um, event, and then um, for party favors, she gave these. So this is the one I picked <laughs> because she gave me a party favor as well. Miss Mary, Miss Mary, um, that was Noah's birthday. So. That. Okay, I'm just trying to gather all this stuff here, but I I love I love the Ukula implement. Okay, so then Bath and Body Works always gives me a coupon, you know, to come back and spend more money. Free wallflowers. Um, I hope it's still good. It says I need glasses. Up to February 18. Yay! Twenty percent off your entire purchase. Got that, and then a free wallflower until the 18th. Body care, $5 until the 18th. So, okay. I think that's all I got. And then when I buy my candles, I do ask for the, the crate because that's how I store them um, so that they can stack on top. And then if I want to pull them, because they're in, um, I have a bar here in the studio and then um, in the cabinet with the bar. I have like four stacks. <laughs> um, but then I keep it and then when I buy new ones, then I just replace, um, just add on to it. Okay, so I was telling you guys that I wanted to try out the Bath & Body Works um, warmer. So this is their fragrance melt warmer is what they call it. I got this for $5, so you can't beat it to try something, $5. And so I said, okay, well, I'll try it because um, I love, I love my Scentsy, Scentsy bar. That doesn't mean that I'm going to start, you know, using other wax milk, but then I try too. I just know that I like my scent. There's like sweet cream and spice, gingerbread donut, my Kahiko Hula, my Kamo Kamo, my Havana Havana. There's just so much Scentsy item wax, um, wax bars that I love. But then I try, you know, I try because like part of this haul is just um, mac uh, wax melt. I don't know what they call it. Do they call, call it wax melt from Bath & Body Works? Okay, so they're warmer. It's just a plain white and it looks like it's plastic or ceramic. It's not plastic, so like a ceramic, but not, 
not the kind of ceramic that I'm accustomed to with Sensi. Not like a clay ceramic, more like a plasticky ceramic. I don't know if that makes sense. Okay. But um, their plug um, goes inside. Mm, I wish I had a... Okay. So it comes with a white cord, a pretty long one, and then just like the Sensi warmers, it comes with a toggle switch. It is pretty long, slender in length. I'm not going to complain for $5, so I thought it was a really good deal. And does it come with a light bulb? Okay, it comes with a light bulb. Does it say what kind? Okay, so this one is an input 120 volts. Um, max wattage is 25. Suitable for dry location only. I'm reading the bottom. Um, okay. Important safety instructions. Safety operating. 25. Use only a 25 watt light bulb. Um, okay. So here's the light bulb. Um, is it the same light bulb as my Sensi? Let's see. At the same. It's a. Here's a. I have a. My gold crush in here. I just wanna basically see. Nope. This is a 25 watt. This is a 25 watt. But this one is bigger than the Sensi one. So I thought I'd share that because I am comparing um, light bulbs or warmers. I just wanted to see. Okay, so I'm gonna actually put that in. I'm gonna screw it in because I am curious to see how it works. Now when you buy the warmer, it just comes as is like this with the with the plug and then it comes with the light bulb and then it comes with the dish and then this dish is just a white white dish. Um, it's a pretty nice size dish, I think. So um, here's a here's a dish that I have from Sensi. This is from the Sand Castle. So when you put it into the rim to rim, um, seems to be like the same width, same width, and um, nice. I like it. It's nice and white. You guys know me. I like my white, so it looks like that. So this is normally $16. Um, I got it for five. And then you buy, and then you buy the wraps. I don't know what they call this, but the, the sleeves. I'm so gold. So you buy the sleeves. So I happen to have bought this one. There was a couple of options. This one is normally, normally $10. And then I got it for, I don't know, three or four. So it's gonna go over, uh, oh. Okay, maybe we should take this out first. It's gonna go over like that. And compared to the Sensi wraps that we have, we have a lot more room for it to, to go around. This one, because of the base here, there's a little lip at the bottom. They want it to fit inside that lip. So it's more, I feel that it, it's it's more tighter fit than the Sensi wrap. So this is what um, what Bath and Body Works calls a sleeve for their um, what is what do they call this box? This is a fragrance melt warmer. So I chose. They had silver ones. They had a flower one. They had one that had like like a diamond kind of thing sticking out. So I wanted simplicity. So I chose a gold gold one that. And then the dish is gonna go on top for five dollars again it was 80% off I'm pretty satisfied with how it looks I like it I'm always willing to try out new things and for me the way I see this is just like when I first started buying um, now I, I haven't bought any Target or Walmart warmer since I became a consultant um, because I do have all these warmers but prior to becoming a Sensi consultant, I did purchase um, Walmart and Target brand uh, warmers, and they were okay. I was pretty happy with it. The most expensive warmer I bought from Target was twenty four ninety nine, and it was the one like a um, like a clear mason jar. 
Um, I I was happy with it when I purchased it. I kept it um, for a bit. But now knowing like the quality of the the Sensi, like this one right here, it just happens to be in front of me. This is the Gold Crush. This is retiring. So February is the last month that we'll have this. If we have anything left, it'll probably go on clearance. But this is heavy. Super, super heavy. And I, the warmers that I got from Walmart and Target, they weren't they weren't this heavy heavy so I know the quality that Sensi does offer so I'm pretty appreciative of that okay got that okay so with with the what do you call this um with the white barn fragrance melt warmer I just threw away the box behind me so I'm looking at that I did purchase some wax melt I believe they call it wax melt fragrance melt fragrance melt so they were offering it into the lotions that um, Bath and Body Works offers and so there these were normally 450 for one this is a 97 ounce this is six dollars and this is a 32 ounce and if you buy this at Sensi for the bundle and save you get six six bars for thirty dollars so you get one bar free I always say bundle and save and then this one I think they had like a special of like three I want to say three three for fifty no because that doesn't make sense because it's four four times three I forgot but if you purchase like three regular price then it smells so good so I'm accustomed to the Japanese cherry blossom scent because I do have that in the lotion form and the body spray form so I do I do like it the smell of it on this um, fragrance melt that they call it really like that one so I got that one for like 70 cents 75 cents uh, warm apple pie got that one again all my scents were like 70 70 cents so I wanted to to try them it smells like apple pie it smells like apple pie if I had just closed my eyes and somebody put this under my nose it smells like a slice of apple pie okay and not one of those fake apple pies it just it smelled like a real apple pie so this one is cinnamon caramel swirl it's it's hard to open though Ooh, I like that sweet cinnamon caramel you can smell most of the caramel and not too much of the cinnamon puree it smells good Who's that, hubby? Ooh, so, okay, with one, it comes with four cube. Four, uh, four separations, I don't wanna call it cube because it's, it's, a, it's round and then, but there's the separation at the bottom. And just like the Sensi, Sensi bars, when you turn it upside down, you can smell more at the bottom. I really like that too, okay, really like that. All right, Sensi, you got some competition here. This is Cactus Blossom. They're so tiny. I wish they were bigger. Um, I like that one too. Citrus um, Cactus Blossom. I like to turn it upside down. I like the magenta color. More stronger at the bottom. Ah, oh, smells good. Okay, I should have picked up a lot more. They were 70 cents. Ah. Oh. Okay, I was in a budget. Like I told myself, okay, $20, that's it. Okay, whatever I get for $20 kind of thing. I don't know what my budget was, but I said that's it, no more. Because I can't overindulge. Pumpkin pecan waffles. All of them so far smells really good and I cannot wait to melt them. <sighs> ah, that smells really good. It just smells like the candles. I don't know what they're made out of um, because of course with the Scentsy I know what they're made of and it's more healthy healthy wax but I haven't um, I have not found out what these um, are made of okay pure white cotton I'm a, fam I'm a I'm a I'm familiar with that as well because I do use their their lotion very hard to open okay Yes, it smells exactly like the lotion. Oh, pure white cotton. 
I love things that make my house smell good. I love things that make me smell good. Um, I love to put lotion on. Like I always use ba um, Bath and Body Works lotion or the Body Shop lotion. That's my go-to lotion. I love the body butter. It just makes my skin feel soft. And I'm not joking, friends. I'm just sharing this with you. It might be TMI, so cover your ears. But my skin is like butterly soft. Even hubby says that. The kid says that. Danny, Danny have said that before, like, Mom, your skin's, your skin's so soft. And I feel myself sometimes, like, you know, with, when I feel myself, I, like, my shoulder, I'm like, oh, my skin is so soft on my legs. Oh, it's so soft. Because I do use um, body butter. It smells so good. Okay. I like to smell good. There's nothing wrong with that. I may not get my nails done, but I spoil myself with smelling good lotion wise and house watermelon lemonade so i like the packaging of that one uh, and watermelon lemonade i know i got that one in candle form um last haul i believe it's last haul i want to say i shared it with you guys because i i saw some into the cabinet it smells good nice for spring uh i love watermelon watermelon scents okay this one is pure white cotton as well and i already it's just a different packaging i don't know why it's different but it's the same so i'm not gonna open that another japanese blossom they got me because it's a different packaging so i was trying to get like different packaging um i got two of these the cactus blossom they were smells really well beautiful day so i think that one's more like a spa scent yeah, more of a spa. It's clean, refreshing. It's nice to um, melt this in the bathroom, I think. Um, floral. Mm, floral. See, again, with um, even with the Bath and Body Works, I wish that they, they put in there what it consists of, like jasmine and, you know, whatever it does. Because you know, it's empty. There's no writing in there so bath and body works if you're listening as a customer and they all smell good so might be a future future purchase customer it'd be nice if you can tell us what the scents are in in here because it's just you know it's going to waste that white paper it's just going to waste just add something in there of a description okay all the scents i have they're they're all lovely i i like every single one of them i cannot wait to melt it um okay let me just show you i got four four candles um cactus blossom that's like that one yep they they smell the same from the wax the wax fragrance i think is a fragrance melt and the candle smells um exactly the same all right so i cannot wait to to burn that oh okay oh friends let me step out okay this is why I almost forgot. This is why I've been waiting for so long to to show you guys this haul. It's because I wanted to purchase that. So make sure to remind me not to forget. Okay, Georgia Peach. I like Georgia Peach too. I, I've gotten this before. Peach is a uh, it's a great um, spring and summer scent for me. In California, I used to melt this, um, burn this during the springtime because over there it's like summer year round. But over here, we're just trying to get out of winter. We're just trying to survive winter. It's still cold. Don't let the sun out fool you today. And it's still like 40 degrees out. That smells really good. And that was Georgia Peach. This one is Praline Pecan. And I like these, um, these toppers. They have special toppers. Uh, smells like caramel, pecan, but more caramel, sweetness of caramel. Hmm, really good. Praline pecan. Oh, doesn't say pre um I smell caramel. I smell caramel in here, but praline pecan is just like melted sugar, right? So that's where the caramel um scent comes in. That's what caramel is, it's just melted sugar. Okay. Last one is the pineapple mango. I bought I bought a couple of this. Danielle also gifts them to her friends. Um, when they have like birthdays and they ask for candles, we always have candles to gift. Whew. So I don't burn all of them at once. 
Okay, so really excited about this one. I waited for this one on, um, I got this at Hobby Lobby, but I had been waiting for this and I had been eyeballing this and I wanted to wait for it to go into 50% even though I could use the 40% coupon, but I wanted it with the 50% coupon. So what it is, is a candle warmer lantern, okay? Um, wooden candle warmer lanterns. So I love this one because it just, I don't know, it just goes well with my decor. But it says it's safe, no flame, eliminates the dangers of burning candle indoors, clean no smoke or soot, capture the light and ambiance of a burning candle without smoke or soot in the air and on the walls or ceiling. Quick, long lasting halogen lamp bulb, bulb quickly melts candle to release the fragrance. So friends, what this is, is if you guys can see this, you see how the mat, the, the candle uh, wax on top is melted, but yet the the wick is not being burned. So what this is is that you plug it in, and then it has a low wattage. So the so the heat source is at the top, I believe. I thought it was a heat plate. Wait. Okay, let me open it. I don't want to say the wrong information. I did get this over at Hobby Lobby. It's called the Candle Warmers. I want to say that the heat source is at the bottom. I'm very intrigued by this product. Okay. Yep. Okay. So, the heat source is at the top. So, it has that, that halogen bulb. So, what's going to happen is that it's going to melt. I shall open this. And it's it gets plugged in. Okay. So, it's it's so cute okay so it's gonna plug in so it has so this is gonna go through out here okay hold on okay so all right so it goes the cord goes down out there's a hole here and it instead of a toggle switch it has a button here's the plug the plug here's a plug Here's a button on and off and then what happens is that we put our candle here. Okay, I'm gonna support it. The, the heat lamp, it turns on, so then it melts the wax. That's so cool. So then you're not burning the, um, the wick and the, the candles, what's, um, it's safer. So instead, you know, sometimes the reason that I don't like to burn candles so much is one, because of the the black smoke that comes out <laughs> when you're blowing it out that's why with me honestly when i when i turn off my candle i just put the lid on they say don't do that but then i'm putting the lid on and then it's underneath my um my fan my kitchen fan the vent and then i'll open it up and then all the smoke is just gets sucked up okay i don't like to blow it but another thing even though you're just not blowing it as as it's burning you're, you're burning off the, I think it's called the soot. Um, and that, they said, is the one that's cancerous when you're burning the, can, the candle like that. That's why they don't recommend it, especially for people that's very sensitive with their lungs. Um, so I love the smell of candles. I still burn it, but I do burn candles limited when I know that I really need to burn it when I'm frying, cooking, especially with food. And then when visitors come, I try to burn my candle like 10 minutes before they arrive. So it really warms up the house um, with a nice fragrance. And then I cover it and then I just have my Scentsy. So it's just an added fragrance for me. Scentsy is what I use 90% um, of the time. But with this, with this and it's cute, look at that. Um, I can't wait to try this out and give you guys a review. This is called the Candle Warmer, I believe. Yep. Candle Warmers. It's a wooden candle warmer lantern. And that's what I got. I believe this was... I forgot how much. I, forgot. I think they were, they were pretty pricey, though. I think they were like $60. $60 or close to $60, and I had gotten it for about $30 with tax and everything. And we have a high tax rate of over 10%. So that's my haul. Um, I can't wait to try out Bath & Body Works fragrance melts. I got a really good deal on their warmer. Can't beat that. Even if it's regular price of $16. If you guys have not bought any warmers. I know I do Scentsy videos here. I'm not 100% like, oh, buy Scentsy. No, I, I sell 
I sell Sensi. I'm a consultant. I tell you guys about Sensi's because I love it. But I also, I also love other things, you know. Um, cannot wait to try this product. As always, guys, thank you for, for visiting with me here at a Simply Simple Life. And I just saw somebody pass by, but I have to take Danielle. Hey, Danielle. Okay, go over there so I can see. I was telling you my other video, Danielle is um, having... Danielle, show them your artwork. I don't have on the phone, on the phone. Um, I want to show you guys her artwork. We're very proud of her. She's very artistic. She loves music. She does. She plays the ukulele, you know, and she's just very um, artistically minded child, which I have no clue. But Danny and hubby is like that too. Jonathan and I are like, eh, we don't know how to come. Well, he knows. He's li he listens to music. I just don't. I sing my kids lullaby and it's a Filipino love song <laughs> and it's the only lullaby I've ever sung them so they know that song to heart and they don't even speak Filipino but they know that song even Danica knows that song so I have sung one song in the whole how old is Jonathan now 17 17 years and it's a Filipino love song called Nandito Ako this is what she did so it's called tell, tell them it's a self portrait yeah and she used oil base Oil pastel, pastels. oil pastel, and she got. Uh, she's getting an award with Scholastic Art. What is it called? Scholastic Art. Yeah, it's no, it's Scholastic. Scholastic. And then it's in the art. Category. In the art category. Yay! So she's getting an award for that tonight. So I'm skipping hula for that. She's getting all dressed up. So friends, as always, you know we're so busy here, but I do share what I can share, and I always share the things that I love. That's it. So, oh, look out for a video because a company sent me a product to to test out, and I have been wanting this. I have been wanting an Instapot for so long. They gave me their version of an Instapot, so it's basically like all-in-one kind of thing. I want to try out some recipes before I show you guys because I really want to be real when I tell you guys stuff. I only share and I only show you guys things I love. I don't pretend. So this is real. I cannot wait to try this one. I have been eyeballing this. Finally went 50% off. Okay? Friends, mahalo and have an amazing week.